So let's now check what we call the channelization, which is the middle part here. Uh, basically, the goal of this part is to go from a high number of partial that we have here on, on the first analysis and down to 64. So that's kind of a challenge, but we have some algorithms to, to, to do this. So if we take that haha -ha voice we had previously, uh -huh. If I do uh, an analysis using the voice preset, uh -huh. that, that does work quite well, and I get 15,380 partial. So that's really a lot. The first thing I have is that frequency tracking of the fundamental frequency we, we are hearing. Uh, so it's important because this is going to be input for the channelization. Uh, so you have some information, the visualization here, with the maximum frequency, 338, the median frequency, and the minimum uh, frequency. We will see later that some sometimes the result here is not good and m then may give bad result when going to channelization. Um, you can set the minimum frequency the maximum frequency that will be accepted by the algorithm, but also uh, the steps. So here you can see that you ha we have some big steps. That's not a big issue, but if you want to take it down, if, uh, if I put it to 16, here, re-estimate, and uh, it's a finer grain um, uh, analysis of the uh, fundamental frequency. Uh, something which is, is useful in some case, you can play it. Mm. So that, that's a fundamental frequency that, that you're hearing. Uh, w w when the guess is bad, you can force it to a specific value. Uh, for example, here we see that the medium is, is 3, uh, 11, so it's a value here. You can set it to whatever you, you want. It may have happened that the, here you got a flat line and then the channelization will not be able to do uh, anything. Uh, if, if there is a value you know it it has to be fixed uh, no 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 change um, and and you want to force it that's something you can use uh, i'll try to give some demo of, of uh, how to use it in other uh, video uh, so that's basically how this works uh, i will uh, just after give an example of uh, how to set it when when things go wrong uh, so we have this 15000 partials and if I do this what we call channelization it, this will run the algorithm uh, that will use that uh, fundamental frequency uh, as input uh, and, and try to reduce the number of partials basically what it will do is try to align all the partials it keeps to uh, uh, natural uh, partials, to, uh, natural harmonics. So if you start at 100 hertz, there will be 200, 300, uh, 400, and so on every 100 hertz. Uh, and it will gather, put together uh, partials which are close. And uh, to do this, uh, uh, the, the, we, we use the, the noise uh, I mentioned that the, in the first video. Uh, we have some noise bandwidth, and when you put two partials which are close all together, if you add uh, a little bit of noise to that uh, bandwidth noise to that specific partials, your hair will not be able to hear the difference. So uh, that's basically what it's doing. That's a little more complicated than this, of course, but 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 that that's a reduction of the number of uh, partials. So if I click here, uh -huh. you see that I went down from fifteen thousand to 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 one hundred and thirty nine, which is good, but that's still not sixty four. Uh, here, once I'm to that point, if if I'm not yet at sixty four. Uh, you can do a simplification additional one. Basically, it will here remove the frequency under 40 Hz if there are some and remove uh, the frequency over 11 kilohertz if there are some. Uh, it will also remove you. I remember I, I said that the analysis will be split in slices, so 512 slices. If it happens that one partial lasts less than one of these slices, it, it's useless. It will remove remove it. Uh, there's also, if it's not enough, remove residue. Uh, 
uh, that you can check or not if you basically by default it's not checked that's to tell the uh, algorithm to try to remove partial that he thinks it's they, they, they won't no, they will not be useful so uh, it's kind of guess not not always useful but that, that's something you can try so if you hit uh -huh. I'm at 71. That's not 64, but that's close en enough. Uh, you need to go to the next step, so just kind of anticipating on it. If I extract this, I will keep the 64 higher partial, and uh -huh. that's what you are getting. So you can go to that, that extraction of 64 even if the simplification was not uh, enough. I, I, I can retry uh -huh. my analysis exactly the same. Uh -huh. Check if the remove residue can do better. Uh -huh. Doesn't really help. Something you need to know is uh, depending on of what you've done here, the, the predefined settings you have used, the channelization will be more or less efficient. So if I use a stamp, uh -huh. uh, let's say you, you see, you see we, we have a drop here uh, at 168, which is not great. So to remove it, I will tell the algorithm that most probably uh, anything under 200 hertz is uh, not to be used. So just select this, type 200 on the keyboard or, or rotate do raise team eight, and so that's done. So we were in standard. We did that correction. Uh -huh. Do channelization. We were at seventy one still. Uh -huh. And now we are we are at forty nine. So you so I just used from voice to standard. A little bit of change, and that's better. You can't really hear the difference if I extract it. Uh -huh. It, it's it's good enough, so yeah, that that's basically the the principle. So you've seen once already uh, how to remove uh, the 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 faulty guess on the frequency check. We can do it on uh, another uh, sample, some drag and dra drag and drop, something I have here. Uh, it's a voice. It's so it's not. A very good input sample, a lot of reverb. Uh, it's not uh, a bit too high, but anyway, we, we, we can try to see what we are getting. Yeah. So you see, here uh, I already have that minimum frequency set, so but if I do it again, so here, if you look at the frequency guess, it looks Kind of crazy. Uh, it's the medium is 493. It's quite high pitch, but but obviously this 96 is not good. So uh, my guess is that probably things need to be over 400. If I do reestimate, um, okay. It looks. Let's play it to see what we get. Okay, so the first note we are hearing, which is quite high, is due to the previous note on, on, on the analysis. Let's listen to it. This small note here. So either we accept it, either uh, we have a, another selection, but it's, it's, it's right. So from that we can do the channel. Check, check, we already, it's a, it's a high pitch uh, voice, only 20 partials are sufficient. Now, if I don't do what I did previously, if I do again the analysis, do the channelization, see, fine tuning that fundamental frequency check is really important if you want to go down to the 64 limit we, 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 we need to reach. So that's basically how this is working. So that's really to lower the number of partials from a very high number that can be tens of thousands uh, to 64, which is what the again matrix can, can manage for, for now. So th that's it. So see, and see you in the next video.